Yo, Future Zaf here, not to waste your time, the event is bugged. I just wanted to edit that in since I tested it during the video itself. So if you want to see why, I just watch the video. If not, hold off on doing the event just yet. But anyways, let's go ahead and start the video. That way you can see why. In this video, I am going to cover the new event. There are some things you might miss and some errors you could make. So I want to make them for you. That way everyone understands how the events do work. And I do want to mention some other tips as well in this video. So do stay tuned. But first off, if you have yet to support us, be sure to do so. We are fighting for our lives trying to get that rank number one spot. So let's do our best to beat Ochi Games. They are rank number one. We are rank number two, but we have so many supporters. We are so close, I can taste it. So let's go to the supporter page. Do support us. I will be giving out codes to our top supporters, of course. And also anyone else who does have a supporter tag on them. This will be done through the net ID once the codes are released, which should be very soon. I believe in less than a week, so do stay tuned for that. I do have a new method for giving out codes where no one can steal the codes I give you, so don't worry. But also I do want to shout out... Um, I do want to shout out the Golden for being the first commenter in our last video. Congratulations to you, and enjoy your very exclusive Discord role. And um, sorry about those uh, images earlier, I have this virus. It's highly infectious, guys. I don't know what's going on. But anyways, now we have new event treasure hunt. But one thing I do want to check really quick. I was alerted by Pross on our Discord server that we're not getting event rewards. That's very strange. So let me hop into a instance dungeon. This could be very important. You don't want to use your keys just yet in case you'd have Zuha fix it. So let me waste one of my keys here just to quickly see whether or not the event is working or not. It's going to hop in really quick. Don't mind me, this will be a very quick run. Generally speaking, I think these runs have taken, what, like 30 seconds or something for me? They really need to up the tiers here. I'm going to leave it on auto, just so I can talk. But yeah, with this event, we're getting some fantastic rewards, let me tell you. We're getting, what, 30 summons from one event, 50 summons from another, and is the auto combat just cooking right now? Well, it failed there, but it's doing pretty well. This is actually kind of amazing. That shadow step was top, top tier. But anyways, we're getting 80 total summons, a free skin. We're also getting a free SSR, and it landed another shadow step. This is honestly very cool. I didn't know auto combat was so good. Oh, wow. Sub 40 run. That's pretty good for auto. Anyways, let's see if we get the rewards. Every gate, every instance dungeon, every encore mission. We're supposed to get rewards, and do we get them? We didn't get any rewards. That's interesting. Huh, so everyone, I think you should potentially, if you can, hold off on using your keys. Um, let me try gates. So, I don't want to use my keys, but I can use gates. I don't mind wasting gate keys. Let me hop into gates, because this is a big issue. The reward, the event rewards are honestly very good, so we don't want to miss out on them. Uh, let's go to gates. So this is good I'm making this video. Again, shout out to Pross for letting me know. Join our Discord server if you haven't. We have a fantastic community. So let me rescan these really quick. I'm looking for a red gate, and I'll have a gate video coming up because there's a lot of changes in the gates uh, recently. And um, Sai in our Discord server did give me a really good list on the gates and basically the priority you should have for gate completions. So I'll cover that in a future video, maybe this weekend. I'll put that on my list, but we're looking for a red gate here. Okay, so we have a red gate as a, yeah, okay, perfect. I'm gonna sweep this. Do we get any event rewards then? No, no event rewards. Um, that's kind of a big deal. Let me let me hop back into the event page on the actual website. That way I can cover how the event works. Because if we're not getting the rewards, that's a big, big issue. So if the devs are watching, I'm not sure if it's me, if I'm doing something wrong here. Because a lot of people have noted this. Let's hop into the page. Where is it? Okay, okay I'm going to switch screens. Give me one moment here. <laughs> This darn virus, someone needs to help me with this. I don't know what's going on. Okay, um, we have the event period. So this is for the 50th day celebration. Let me find the gate. So how to participate, clear gates, encore missions, and instance dungeons to earn the 50th day celebration coins. So I should have gotten them potentially. I'll do a few more because I don't mind wasting my resources for the viewers, just so they understand better. I don't want everyone else to waste their keys and get nothing for it. That's a huge waste. But the event period, so yeah, it did start now. So it should be in progress. This is after the Tuesday patch. So we are now in UTC time. So this is the current time for UTC. Well, well, it's technically 30 minutes in, doesn't matter. 
as of the recording of this video, of course. So going back to the event, let's test it out a few more times because that's kind of unfortunate if it isn't working out. So let me rescan again. Sorry for the rescans. I'll try doing some B gates as well. Sweep them. There we go. So let's sweep this. Any rewards? No. Wow. 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 So everyone, please don't use your. Yeah, don't. Don't use your keys yet. We might get a hotfix, so don't do anything just yet. Okay, well, glad I made this video. Yeah, thank you, Pross. Shouted him out three times, but again, it was due to him telling me that I checked out this event uh, earlier than usual, so very good. Now we know, so for this event right here, you're supposed to get the keys, or the stars, whatever they are. But in this case, we're not getting rewarded for the event. It's active. We can see it's active. So this could make the difference between getting, you know, all these rewards and missing out on some. You do not, under any circumstance, want to miss any of these awards, even the worst tier right here. And don't get me started on the Power Elixir 2s, these are so rare to get, I only have 13, so this event is very stacked in terms of rewards. So again, don't do any key missions just yet, I'm 100% sure that the devs will have an update coming out very soon. That does fix this, at least I hope, otherwise we lose a day, so maybe they can extend the event for one day. Anyways, uh, you know, I'm gonna do a few more gates just because... It could just be very rare to get, though I don't see how that could be the case since it would be far too rare. We did a bunch of gates. Let me find another one. I'll cut to the gate being found. Oh, there we go. We just got one. Sweep again. Any rewards? No. No rewards. I'll do one more red gate. Oh, perfect. Wow. Thank you, devs. You must be helping me out with this video. And do we get one? No. Okay. The event is bugged. Has to be bugged. There's no way I did all those gates. What? Five gates and one mission. Six total. No rewards. Yeah. It's bugged. So, ooh, that's not good. So devs, please fix it, the event is bugged. So PSA to everyone, don't use your keys just yet. Maybe check back in a few hours for the event to be updated potentially, but yeah, we'll have to see. Anyways, uh, let me know if you're actually in the event rewards or not, but I guess most of you aren't. If I'm not, I do update my game routinely. So yeah, let's hop back to the next event. Where is it? Oh, one tip I do want to mention is for the workshop building slate. If you use a raid and you don't complete it, and reset does happen, it gets wiped. So you can't do a raid, enter it, and wait for the reset to occur, and then continue it afterwards. No, 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 no. It gets reset, finish, etc. So you can't continue it. So just know if you're saving a run right before reset to complete it, or try to complete it, otherwise you'll lose out on whatever progress you've made. So let's go back to the event. We have this one right here, Treasure Hunt, and Special Dice, that's not new. So let's go to the new event, Treasure Hunt. Let me get the event shop rewards right here. And let me check the packages. Anything good here? Usually event shop purchases aren't the best. I mean, depending on how good these are, it could be a good buy, but just based on these general rewards, it is not. So we have one of those orbs. Do I just click it? Okay, I do click it and I get a reward. Interesting. So for this, what are we looking for exactly? I guess we just clear the board, right? And every time we get 50 clears, we get the maximum reward here. And then 30 every single time after that. And the rate info is here, so nothing too major from the looks of it. It looks like we're guaranteed to get all the rewards eventually, so it's split into 50. That's okay. So basically 4% for each. Are there any super rare rewards? No. So it's just evenly distributed, which makes sense. There should be, what, 25 of these? 1, 2, 3, 4, yeah, so 25 with those given rates. That's good. And the missions, okay, we have missions as well. We get the rewards. Let me do a few more, just see what it's like. Clicking random talents, 30k gold. And one more here, hunter scrolls, one more here. And we get the marks of time, that's a good one. So if we go back to the right info, those should be claimed. So yeah, it doesn't really matter what the rates are. They're 4% each, and then once you start claiming them, the rates do go up, so that's good to know. And how about this one, the best reward, worth details. So I guess that's additional rewards once we do the treasure hunt. This event is actually kind of confusing. Reward details. Oh, I see. Once we do the quests. So repeated treasure board hunts. We get the skill rune chest. I'm assuming. I don't know. Strange reward system here. There's no information tab here. But I'm assuming once we get one full treasure board completed. Since there is six. And there's, I guess, six rewards total. Five and then repeated one. We'll get these rewards. So that's okay. That's nothing too fancy. Yeah, I don't see anything really good there. Well, free rewards are free rewards. I won't really complain about that. But yeah, this full completion is actually very good. Getting a heroic rune every single time for completing it. Obviously, we'll take some time. How many do we get from missions here? One, one, and one daily one. So four every 10 days. So basically through the event, we're only completing this once, I'm guessing. 
So that's fair. You know, nothing too crazy in terms of rewards, but at least we do get something. If you purchase the event stuff from the shop, obviously, it'll be much easier to complete it. And I think potentially it's not a bad buy if you do need runes, but for what, 15-ish dollars, not too worth it in my opinion. You have 500 diamonds for this. No, I wouldn't do it personally, but again, up to you. And that should cover the events that are new. Again, this one isn't working, so do hold off on it. And the check-in event for Jiwu skin starts tomorrow, so don't worry. If you're missing the check-in event, it hasn't started just yet. For that event, we're getting, what, 30 summons total, I believe. Her weapon for free and her skin. I'm going to pop that open right here. So yeah, you see that starts tomorrow. Very good. So make sure to log in if you're not playing. That way you are getting these awards since this is the best login event to date, I think, with the exception of potentially the first launch of events. Yeah, most likely. So yeah, do log in, get these awards, and don't forget, you should be supporting us if you haven't. Link will be down below. When codes do come out, I will prioritize the... When codes do come out for the creator program, I will be prioritizing individuals who are on the supporter program. I believe last time we were able to search up the user's ID, and give them the codes that way. If not, that's totally fine. I'll use the member ID. Let me show you where it is one second. So this ID right here under settings, the account details, you'll just post this code in the comments and probably another message. Otherwise it will get filtered out and then I can just copy it, send you the code directly. You'll just get it in your inbox. Super, super standard. That way there's no chance for your code to be stolen. And you know what I just realized? They changed the coupon. It used to be 20%. I think it was a typo. So they did update it. Okay, that's good to know as well. Anyways, yeah, that was it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed. There is an issue with the event, so make sure to hold off on spending your keys and do subscribe for future videos. And of course, like the video as well and drop a comment whether or not the event is working for you. This was Zaf signing out.